What's up guys, Nintendo Void here with more Spacecom for you. Uh, let's play, basically, going through the tutorial missions again, episode 3. Um, last time I left off, we're on, I think this is mission 5? I can't remember which one it was, but I did have to restart the mission to get us all the way back to where we were. I'm not exactly sure where we were on this mission, but I'm pretty sure we are where we left off. I have a shield here, and I'm building one in my new, uh, uh building base here, factory base basically, and I'm taking over some back systems now. So let's just get right back into it. Um, and we can stop once we finish this stuff right here. So let's send this guy over with these dudes. Basically, now that I have this shield system up, you know, no, none of my guys take damage, and now I don't have to send them all the way back to get repaired all the time. So that's kind of what I'm doing here too. Uh, once I get shields here, I should be pretty good, and then I'll probably start setting up some battle stations to help me fight. Um, because I don't think they take supply, and so with my supply, I'm going to have to have tons of ships to take out these really huge bases they have. Um, not only to knock out their shields, but then to um, actually uh, invade the systems. So we're going to go back to here. I'm going to get a couple more battle fleets per, and I'll put those in, those, in the systems. I want to have five each. I think we're good here. Yeah, nobody should be hurt. There's one guy who's hurt. I'm going to send him home, or send him to get repaired. And I'll send this guy, I'll just keep grabbing these systems here. So again, if you look, when we have fights like this, basically they hit the shields before they hit any ships, which is really cool. That makes it very easy. Uh, and my guys can take this guy out safely. Uh, and the shield regenerates after every battle, as far as I've seen. That's what happened last time, so. Um, yeah, these are getting snagged right here. They're getting blocked, and I don't think I can change any of that stuff, so. It is what it is. So that's the only problem with having like a factory system like really close to the front here. So this guy's probably fine now. Let's send him on to here and let's let's get these these guys invading. Actually, we might as well send this guy over to here. By the time he gets there, they're going to be done. So they're just sending in these small units. I'm I'm, I'm going to imagine that they're pretty soon they're going to get even stronger. But we will see. So I'm building a couple extra fleet units there, battle fleets. And then I'm going to start building, once those ships are complete, I'm going to build the, the planetary defenses or whatever they are. And then I'll keep working on building uh, more battle fleets to, to help me bombard those systems. Kind of thinking I'm going to need, let's see, we need to send another guy home, don't we? Kind of thinking I'm going to need like 10, probably 10 ships to take each system. I mean, that's just a guess, but... Because if you look over here, well, there, there are no dudes here. So I could bombard the system first, but I'm wondering if I probably need to take that over like 10, um, not 10 battle fleets, but 10 invasion fleets. Because I need to be able to get through that. So really what I have to do is I have to take over their base here. So I think all I need to do, is I can bust through this and then bust through here. I don't need to go through this big one because it has a connection. So I'm going to try to do that. This is the, where they're building ships too. So if I can take that, it'd be really awesome. Um, I don't know what that has. It might have a shield. Maybe I haven't seen it yet. But I'm going to basically I'm going to take over this guy first. I'm going to take out his, his planetary defenses. Still going to need like 10 guys probably to do that. So these guys should be ready to let's just invade real quick. Then I'll have all these back systems taken. This guy should be good. And what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to go here just to get ready for, to invade. So I think four ships will be good here for now. So once this guy pops a ship out, what I'll probably do... Let's do... I want to go with ten ships attacking. So let's do another one of those. Let's move this guy in. Now he has five. And we should be... Oh no, the shield does not regenerate that quickly anyway. See how the shield's taking some damage there? So I don't know if, that, if I have to rebuild it or what. If that's the case, it doesn't seem like it's worth building if it doesn't regenerate, because I can regenerate my ship hit points. Maybe they teach you how to do that. So now I got... Okay, this guy needs to be repaired. I need to repair everybody, because I can't move flying in ships that have damage. Uh, anybody here have damage? Yeah, this guy does. Alright, you're going that way. 
Gotta keep, I think that's one of the biggest things about this game is you gotta manage your ships. Let's send a big dude that way. Um, you need to make sure you don't lose ships because it can be in a game of attrition too, right? Just like a lot of other strategy games where, you know, sometimes like, especially in, this happened a lot in uh, Warcraft 2 where I would beat, I would beat the computer just because I managed my resources so well. And he just would throw a wave and wave after of these really um, expensive units at me. And I just whittle him down with these really piddly units. And then I'd wait till he ran out of resources. Then I'd jack him up. So it was pretty easy to do. Well, it seems like I'm regenerating a little bit of my shields. Because I just took a hit and on my shields and it didn't do anything. I mean, it took me back down to three lost, right? Now i got five lost. So I think you got to keep hitting the shield. But I'm gonna definitely going to take that out. What do we got here now? We got... Five battle fleets. It's really not enough. Let's keep going. I need more. Okay, here we go. Six, so that's six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now when I produce all these units, I'm ready. They keep sending one guy at a time. Why are they doing that? That's stupid. Yeah, this system is like, forget it. It's got a shield and a planetary defense, and it's got four planets. Yeah, uh, I'm not taking that system. I'm just going to bust a hole right through here. Then I'll have to cover three points, though. Look, I'll have three places where I can get attacked. I would imagine they're going to focus on this one system, but still... Maybe I should put planetary defense systems here. That way I can take my ships away and it won't matter too much. I'll just kill them. That's not a bad idea. So I'm going to do that as well before... Oh, we have no people defense here. Fifteen, huh? That's not that much. I've got none here. That's hilarious. Alright, let's take one of these guys over here. So we should be... We're getting a lot closer to being done here with building our uh, fleet that I want to take over there. I'll pro probably, probably lose at least a few ships doing this, I'm sure. So let's look at... See, I can't... I wish you could see the hit points of the shield. But you can't until you get in the fight. I wonder, yeah, that sucks, man. I wish I could check it out and see how damaged it is. So we're going to get in another fight, and I'll be able to check that in a second. Yeah, see, it's regenerated it. Now it only has two hit points down. So that's good. I wonder if it takes resources. Probably. So we've got a huge invasion force here now. I don't think five will be enough, but we got guys over here that are all ready to rock, right? So actually, we don't need that dude. Is this guy done? Mm, not really. This guy is. Let's let's make a planetary defense here. We should be we should have 10 in our fleet now to move out. So what I should do is one yeah, once this is done, I'll wait cuz I want to make sure this planetary defense is up first. They could fly right through. No, they'll have to get locked, I think. I, I don't think you can fly by a planetary defense. Maybe you can. I don't know. I have to check that out. 52. That's pretty costly. How much is your ship? A ship is 29, so that's almost twice as much as a ship. It's probably worth it, though. Oops, sorry about that. I clicked out of it just waiting. Resume. I can speed this up a little bit, but I'm not going to yet. I don't, I don't feel like I'm uh, good enough at this game yet to, to speed it up. Look at all that. Come at me, bro. You're going to die before you even get a shot off. No, is he going to get a shot off? Does it set it back as firing? Yeah, it does. When you get hit, it sets back your loading speed or whatever. You got juice, bro. So that's the last one, and then all the resources will route over to this guy here. So the yellow is potential. See, that's how much is on the move here. And that's how much already is already got there. Has already uh, been received. So let's just take one of these guys and move him over. Let's take this guy, I guess, and we'll just move him. There we go. Now we've got plenty of uh, fleet go to go around here. And six invaders should be plenty for three dudes. I might lose one guy, but probably not. So waiting for that planetary defense to come online. It's almost done. It's just in route now. See, now I can't see the, 
the routing of that of the resources. So sometimes either that's buggy or I'm not really sure why it does that. But it's still coming in. You can see it. It's just you can't see them on the map. I don't know why they throw these guys at me. As soon as this one comes online, I'll, I'll build one here too. That way I can move these ships out of that system. Now I'm pretty sure these guys are pretty buff. Ah, I see. That's how you can tell if there's someone there or not. See how the circle's there? That means nobody's defending that planet. That makes sense. Yeah, they're just throwing guys at the at that for no reason now. Hurry up, dude! It can't be because they haven't gotten here yet. I don't know what the yellow is. Oh, they're building it. So I need to start this so we can start routing some stuff over to here. Oh, I can't. We're in a fight. That's what that's what's going on. So they've received all the materials, but they're still building it. And the problem is, um, now I have all these. I, I'm not using my resources. That's what's going on. So what I need to do here is to start that build, and you'll start seeing resources pop out. See, I think when they're blinking, that means they're building stuff. Yeah, see, they're, now they're sending out resources. Okay. Okay, yeah, so we need to keep these things building is what we need to do. We need to make sure that we've always got something in the queue. Okay, we've got a planetary defense here. We should take that middle system now. Come on, hurry up. <laughs> so let's get in there now. I think we, we're good to go. Well, we're going to... We'll see. <laughs> Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> Ten assault ships and uh, six invaders should be enough, but we'll see. So, hopefully my invaders don't die on the way in. So, he fires pretty quickly. I think that shots just kind of hit random. Wow, okay. I'm hitting them pretty good. Who did he hit just now? Did he miss? I wish that little the battle menu was a little bit faster. Wow, that was easy. I thought I thought for sure that would be way harder than that. Let's invade. Attrition. Remember when your fleets are in enemy territory? Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. Oh, they're dying right now. They're getting hurt. See them? Because they're waiting for this for this this invasion. And now that is that going to stop the invasion? Probably. Yeah. Now I have to go through these guys again. Then I have to invade again. So this is how you can you can kill these you can kill enemies trying to invade is keep sending one ship at a time and so they have to go back into this queue and and then they have to invade again unless let's, let's see if I get to invade where I left off here nope see I got to start the invasion over and these guys get full hit points and my guys don't wow that's kind of cheating almost and there's still attrition on my guys so they're getting hurt just sitting around okay now it's mine. So now what I need to do is build another um, barrier right here because it's going to be the forward uh, area now. So we're going to go with that. And now we should see resources flowing out. Good. We need to send some of these dudes back. Let's send the newbies back because they're the most hurt. They're the probably hardest to keep going here. We'll send back our invaders that are hurt. This is a slow process, man. You don't want to um, lose ships just because you were careless. Uh, probably don't want to leave invaders here because I don't really want them to get hurt. So let's move them back so that we can take the next system. The next system's easy. There's no uh, no shields or anything like that. In fact, I could probably take it right now, but why don't we wait until our fleet is repaired here. Actually, why don't we do this? Let's... Mm, kind of feel like moving these guys in. Let's move these guys to bolster this fleet. Then we're just going to take off and take the next one. I mean, there's cautious and there's too cautious, right? This should be a fun fight, though. So these guys now don't have anything to build. So let's start building... Um, what do I need to build probably? Probably a couple battle dudes here. In fact, this one, let's just build another extra right here. So these guys 
still a little hurt, but not too bad. Let's look at this. So you guys, yeah, they're good. Let's move these guys back to here. They're all all the way good to go now. And we'll move a couple guys back. Maybe these guys. There we go. Five guys should still be able to take this guy out before he does anything. Because they're not noobs. They're uh, leveled pretty high. Alright. Looking good. Now you gotta watch to make sure that your Qs stay full. Because if you run out, you know, you run your Qs, Qs down, you're basically just missing out on resources. This is a really long mission. See, now I've got it. This is like no big deal. Nobody even gets hurt now. It's too bad I can't build a, build a repair facility. Yeah. So we'll send a couple more guys back since we, we have the shields. How are these guys doing? They just got here, so they should, they're going to take a second to repair. So these guys are good, right? Let's move these guys up. Oh, wait. We need to keep a couple guys here. How are these guys doing? Okay, they're all repaired. Let's move these guys up here. Hmm, where, where's my production going? Oh, they're done. Um, well, I guess we can start building this since we got nothing else to build. Also, we can start... Let's do that. Let's put a queue in here. We can probably queue up this guy, too. Well, not right now. Let's queue these as well. There we go. Whenever you see those resource guys stop moving, the resource ships, that means you, you, you got a problem. So these guys are awesome. I'm going to send them with my main invasion force. And then I'm going to send... Let's keep the newbies back. I'll take this guy. I'll take these guys. And I'll take all the invaders. We're ready to rock. We're ready to invade. Alright, so we got this guy as well. Let's bring him up here. We need some defense while we uh, invade the next area here. The problem is I'm getting very spread out, so I think what I'm going to do is just bum rush. I'm going to get this guy, and then I'm going to bum rush in and get that one, and just win the whole thing. I don't need to destroy everything, right? Let's take another one of these guys, because I'm just going to bum rush this whole thing. Let's take another one of these, like a newbie. Okay. We should probably build a couple more invasion fleets, too. Alright, we got 18 dudes here, right? So we're gonna need to leave a couple of guys. We'll wait till they till they hit us, then we'll then we'll move out. We got six invaders. We should be able to take both those planets without any problems. I'm gonna move everybody but two battle fleets from that top. We'll probably leave three battle fleets in, in the in the top one there, because we don't have the uh, planetary defenses. In fact, yeah, we could bring these guys out. Let's let's take one of the let's take. Let's take this whole fleet, or are we building it here? Yes. It's being built. We'll take one dude up here. Because we have planetary defense, and we have a shield, so we should have no problems. That's fine, let them, let them do that. Okay, so. Let's take... I wish you could hold shift, but you can't. You can only click one guy at a time. Let's just take that many dudes. We'll take all these guys. And we're going to go to the next system here. This is kind of the long way around, but this is how I like to do it. I, I don't like to take chances, especially in strategy games. Um, I'm just very calculating, and I'm a little bit... Uh, don't, I don't take enough risks, probably. Um, but that's how I win as well. I, I think in order to play the game better, I need to take more risks. I just don't do it. So this should go over, this should be over pretty quick. In fact, they might not even get a shot off. And we should be able to resolve before, yeah, okay, we're done. So I'm just going to take this and right away I'm going to send them in to, to get the, uh, to get the, uh, come on, you going to resolve or what? Let's go and get that capital. Their main base there. I don't know why they're doing that. Uh, while we're doing that, let's let's do that. Let's in, and we'll probably want to do. Well, that's fine. We'll just do that. 
Because these this this is over. This is over. Invade. There we go. So I have their um, shipyard, and now I'm going to have their their uh, the main base. So 10 minutes left of this video. So after I hate how we have to split these up, but I guess it's okay. I'll, I'll just record back to back each time. So anyway, there we go. That mission's complete. Elapsed time 31 minutes. So 10 minutes of prep uh, to get up to where we were before, and then 20 minutes to finish it out. I will be back when the next mission starts. For you guys, it'll be instantaneous. All right, well, we're, I'm back anyway. It's been about a day for you. It's instantaneous, but we're on the next mission here. Looks like we're almost halfway, really, there. So, Strija. Uh, the system is capacity, um, incapacitated, and rebel battle groups are in communication breakdown. Okay, good. However, Abiga, uh, Abigail Summers fled during the final hours of the battle. Intel's tracking her escape. Your success has driven rebel forces. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, Striga Sector hold, hosts three systems in that declared independence, but they hold infrastructure critical for a war effort. Move in and secure them. Okay, this will supposed to lead us, lead us strategic upper hand, and we'll put an example to other systems. So, we've got about ten minutes left of this one, and then what we'll be, what I'll be doing is just uh, flipping over and recording episode four. Um, you know, it'll be basically for me. No time will have elapsed for, for you. It'll be a, a day or two. So. We're going to proceed. Now, this is a little bit more open. Prepare the invasion of Toriga Rubicot. What? Oh, I have a time limit? Where is this place? Toriga Rubicot. Well, let's get this first. Let's get, um... Let's definitely get our repair area here. Toriga Rubicot. Oh, Rubicot right here? Oh, all these places. Triga, Rubicot, Hades. Um, I only see one. Let's see. Let's queue up another, um, uh, battle fleet here. And then I really want to have... Probably need to start building our shields there after a little bit. Because I want to make sure that we can keep that thing. Triga, Rubicot, Hades. Well, we need this, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna get this first. Invade here, Teresa and Tariga. So there's Rubicot. Where's Tariga? Oh, here, in Hades. Ah, okay. So I don't need to take this system. I don't have to take every system that I come across. Let's move this guy here. Be sure that I can uh, make sure that nobody's gonna jack with me there. So their ships are probably gonna be coming from. Neocene, because that's where they have their shipyard, I would, I'm gonna guess. But we also probably need to, to secure this area here. So we're doing good here. We'll let these guys repair, and then we'll probably take over Rubicot here. So if we check these guys out, they should be repairing. Yeah, okay, good. We only have, we only have two guys that need to repair, and then I'll take Rubicot. Uh, Rubicot, Hades, that should be easy-ish to take. I'm gonna station a guy at Hades, I think. Let's let's Yeah, we need two of these. So these guys should be done. Yeah, let's go for Rubicot real quick. This'll get us the back area here. And then we'll get Hades to get that um we're, we really want that production flow. Are there any more production systems? I doubt it. Nope, just their one production system here. I'll probably take that too. So almost there. What is this? This is so easy. There's got to be more. Oh, I have that many minutes to actually... Prepare the invasion. Hmm, that's weird. Don't lose any systems. Finish mission in under 15 minutes. Capture or destroy at least five systems. Well, that's easy. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. Commander, prepare your forces that can move. Plan your approach towards your subsequent need to defend these systems. Yeah, I think for this, I need to get one of these guys and bring them down here. But let's see if we've got... Let's build another battle fleet. We have, we have plenty of invasion fleets right now. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm just going to... Um, I'll take one of the, the... Whoever's damaged, we'll send him back here. And then I'll take these other three and send them up here. That'll be good. So that's my base and my building area. I probably should put... Well, 
I guess once I get enough ships, I'll probably start building shields because right now I can't really do that. So this guy's good. Let's send him up here as well. Oh, so I see what they're good. In 20 seconds, they're going to start attacking. Prepare the invasion. Okay. One ship might not be able to do it. I'm, I'll have to back out of this if they start really hitting me hard. Probably want to keep this guy here, to be honest. Capture. Okay, capture them. Yeah, no problem. We already got Rubicot. We're good. We also need to get this system, though, which means we're going to have to... I, I want to capture that system anyway, so we should be good. Moving in to probably to Rubicot. Okay, so let's do this. Let's move this guy down here. Let's move one of these guys to here, and we'll build another one. Ah, oh, good. Let's queue up a couple more of those dudes. So they're bringing two invasion fleets and one fleet to here. I think this guy should be able to kill off those invasion fleets. Let's bring this guy as well down here. We're going to need that repair system, like, really seriously bad. Invade. Okay, so we only got three guys there. That's fine. It's going to be a, a no-brainer. I should be able to kill these two dudes, but this is going to be still a pretty tight battle. So they're going to Galileo? Galileo? Okay. But hopefully this guy will get there in time to help out. Yep, he's going to. And we'll send this guy to here. He turned around mid midstream? Yeah, that'll be a no-brainer for this. So, this is ours now. Uh, nobody took any damage at all. Uh, let's send all these guys back to here. I want to... Oh, now they're going to there. Okay. Well, we already got a ship there. Oh, man, my guys move faster than you do. That's awesome. How's this going? Going good. There's our... Yeah, they're dead. Okay. And my guy's leveled. So what have we got here? Uh, that should be a pretty easy fight for me. Let's move these guys back to here. In fact, let's move one of these guys up to here since they're leveled. And then we're going to take over that system. Um, we need... What do we have? How many guys do we have? Four invasion fleets? Yeah, we should be able to do it pretty easily. Um, only because when I pass through here, I don't want to take damage. And then we'll take that guy, too. We're going to want to put a dude here, probably. So what do we got? Yeah, we don't need... Let's send this guy to repairs. And we'll send this whole fleet in here. Now, we, we only need the invasion guys. So let's just send the, these guys. Because there's no point in sending those other guys. They'll just get hurt. I'm kind of spreading my dudes out a little bit, but that's okay. So they're invading. What do they got? Just two invasion guys? Okay. So now we have three. Okay, let's send another guy down here. No, just one. There we go. Let's do invade. Let's send these guys in here, because now they're going to try to block my invasion. I think I got this down pretty well. I mean, I, I don't really see any other issues here. So there's a battle here. Hopefully my guys will get there fast enough to keep those guys from getting killed. That's a no-brainer. We probably should install some dudes down here. We got any dudes here? Yeah, we got two guys going, coming in right there. So now we've got some attack fleets coming in. That's good. There we go. Okay, so we'll do an invasion right after this. Hurry up. Okay, invading. Uh, again, let's move these guys ahead. They're just taking damage for no reason. We need just more mainly battle fleets. Let's pick... Let's send one of these guys over here. And let's... Let's advance a little bit. Alright, we should be able to take this. It shouldn't be a big problem. I, I don't... I really don't know why this seems like it's hard. It's really not. This is super easy, actually. Oh, okay, that's fine. Go ahead. So, these guys are a little hurt, actually. Let's take a couple of the guys and go get them repaired. Um, I don't want to lose them. And let's move this guy back to... here, just to protect my invasion guys a little bit. 
We got some really forward guys up here. This should be going really well. Probably need to build a couple of troops here, but that's okay. So the what? Invasion guys? Yeah, no problem. These guys will get killed. So, all right, I think we're going doing pretty good here. I think the main thing you need here really is battle battle dudes anyway. Battle fleets are really the co commanders of their of the map, in my opinion. Um, so we're gonna have to cut this one. Um, so let me pop up the menu right here. We're gonna end this episode and welcome. Thanks for watching episode three. Let me know what you think. Uh, like and favorite and stuff if you like this series. Um, I will be giving away keys. Um, in the regular series, this is really just the uh, tutorial series. I'm gonna pop these up really fast so that we can get to the regular series, and then I'll start giving away keys. I got some extra keys from the developer to give away, and uh, if that goes well, I will probably try it. He said he can offer a couple more keys to give away, so it really just depends on how much you guys like this series, and uh, and these videos. So anyway, let me know what you think, and as always, stay frosty, guys.